G'day mate and welcome back to Capital Ministry with me, GD. In our last episode, we did a couple of things. First off, we planned a ramp all the way down to, well, the middle of the crater. Because no matter what, we need to get access to the middle of the crater. We also told the coal guys to dig, oh, cut a hole directly through the coal mine all the way to the bottom of the crater. Because, well, we need access to the bottom of the crater. Because I left it up to you guys to make the big decision. Do we build in the crater? Nor do we build on the surface. You know, no matter what, we're gonna have to dig out a whole bunch of stuff. No matter what, we're gonna have to dump a whole lot of stuff. But the question is, do we build the main town, the main industrial, everything in the crater or out of the crater? And um, the votes are in, the votes are in. It looks like many people want to want me to go all risk, all reward and build in the crater, which is great because it means all our resources are gonna be very, very close at hand as we push out the crater. It also means if we ever, ever, ever break the edge of the crater, we are get flooded. Yeah, it seems you guys are very, very kind. Anyway, the other thing we managed to do is we managed to get glass building up and running, which now means I can make as many T2 vehicle parts as I want. And uh, today's episode, today's episode, we're gonna have to start the episode off with, um, well, blaming past Jenny. Also, I didn't ask the most important question of all, that is, can I borrow a like? I just like to borrow a like, I just like to borrow a like early in the video because well, there's a chance that you might get called away. There's a chance you might not finish the video. There's also a chance that you might just forget to click the button. So I'm gonna ask early on in the video, can I just borrow a like right now? If you're not happy, by all means, you can have a refund. In fact, I'll give you a 100% refund on that like. Uh, the other thing I wanna ask very, very quickly is we're now in episode 12. Have you clicked subscribe yet? If you haven't, we're probably gonna flood the crater. You probably should, you don't wanna miss this. Anyway, with that out of the way, let's get to uh, blaming past JD. Now, before we get into blaming past Jetty for far too many mistakes, I need to do the important things. I need to thank those that go above and beyond to support the channel. Those that, well, keep this dream alive. First off, I need to thank those that choose to go across to Patreon. Just pop over to Patreon and choose to support there because over there you can do 12 months. I think it's 12 months and get a discount. At the same time, I need to thank those that pop across to Twitch on the weekends when I stream there and choose to click subscribe there because that'll cost you some bezo bucks. And then finally, I need to thank those that support here on YouTube. Uh, today, we need to thank uh, Major Death. Major Death, who is gonna be driving around this little blue truckie. And it's important that, um, well, with Major Death driving this little blue truckie, we should answer the ultimate question, of the risk versus reward. How bad is it if we actually flood the crater? I think that answers the question. I think that's a non-recovery position. Yeah, uh, the crater just disappears and turns into, well, a giant lake with all your resources in the inside. Yeah, risk versus reward. Cool, that's the plan. So now we have that to look forward to. Uh, we need to get around to blaming past Jedi, Jedi for a whole lot of mistakes. Uh, first off, we can see, well, I have no place to dump product. And that is a lot of products. So I need to fix that. Uh, they are signed, up, are signed up to this tower. And currently the only thing we're allowed to waste here, uh, we'll dump here is waste because well, we've filled out this area. I need to quickly enable rock and also slag just so we can continue mining. I need to get some mining done. I need to get some severe mining done. Also need to fill in that section, please. Cool, I need to get that bridge done. We're gonna hopefully get that bridge done fairly quickly and hopefully get a whole bunch of trucks to dump a whole lot of crap in the ground. All right, next problem I need to fix is past Jedi never hooked up, well, uh, the, the fertilizer too to burn off, well, the fertilizer. That being because this truck was in the way. Uh, well, this wall was in the way, wall was in the way. Uh, so we're gonna build these two buckets. Well, this will bring in limestone and this will take out slag. And uh, that means I can burn off sulfur. Very, very important. Uh, also means you are gonna need to get recovered and then we should be good to go. All right, next thing I'm gonna need is gonna need a bucket right here to collect fertilizer two and quick deliver. All right. 
Burly leaves start burning fertilizer, uh, burning sulfur, because if I don't, um, you're backed up. You're currently backed up on diesel, that's great, but you're going to be backed up on sour water very, very soon, so I need to fix this problem. I also have a problem that you can't get trucks in here, but hopefully we'll fix that in just a second. Uh, next thing I need to do is uh, pull off limestone, 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 limestone guy. I want to bring limestone guy around here. The reason I want to bring him around here is I'd really like to put in another farm. And although I could fit a farm here, if I drop a farm right there, we can see um, that is definitely going to be an issue getting trucks past there. So what I want to do is have a small dig zone of this. Now, I sort of have a goat pipe right here that has supports that are technically outside the dig zone. So it should be fine, but it not, might not be fine. So we're going to hope that Mr. Diggy Boy is very, very, very gentle. Very, very gentle. Yeah, uh, hopefully we have no issues. All right, also need to come over here and now we have fertilizer two. I need to get this tank run, uh, well built, which is then going to dump fertilizer two into, well, all these farms. Also need to grab my little pipe from in here and run height two, please, uh, all the way around and bring it uh, up around the side, to there, to there, to there, uh, across here, across here, over to here, around to, yep, around that side of the farm, and over to here. Can I remove that, please? And plug you into there. Okay, I need to be able to get fertilizer over to this farm as well. We're just going to crank this guy up to 120% as well. We can technically go up to 140 with fertilizer too, uh, but I'm going to be happy. So this still says 120, uh, and what fertilizer? Fertilizer in the pipe in the balancer, uh, 121, 122, so on and so forth. So we can go over 120, we go at 140 with fertilizer two. Please don't collapse. Please don't collapse. Gentle, gentle. Oh my gosh, gentle. Okay, uh, technically we go up to uh, 140, but we're gonna stick to 120 for right now. I don't need to burn the fertilizer, I just need to make sure it doesn't back up. All right. Next thing I need to do is we have a uh, stable. We're stable. We've got lots of trucks, but it's stable. So I have 122, no, I have a 110 trucks and I have 22 diggy boys. I want to add uh, to my little list, uh, five, six, seven, eight. I want eight of these guys up and running. Uh, I also want to remove the, that notification. Don't care about that notification. You can go away. We're going to start cranking out a bunch of these. I have a bunch of storage already, um, and I'm going to have eight more diggy boys because I need some projects done, some big projects. We're going to have a lot of terraforming to do, especially if we are building in the crater. Okay, next thing we need to do is I have a low supply of sand, which means I'm going to grab this little sand tower. We're going to build you right here. Quick deliver, please. Edit area there to there and remove and mine 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 yeah we're gonna dig down to no, 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 no not to zero to plus one plus one plus one is what we want we're gonna start digging out some sand from here uh, now, I'm going to need a diggy boy for this. I don't have a diggy boy available, so I'm just going to grab that tower, that tower. Can I just have one diggy boy made available, please, and one truck? That's it. We're just going to have one diggy boy, one truck come do this. Uh, also, where's this one? Uh, can I realign that to there so we don't have that overlap? And I need you to dig all the way through there. Cool. All right. Uh, one diggy boy off and running. All right. Uh, no, 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 don't, no, no, that's potatoes. Don't care about that. Uh, collapse. Don't, please don't collapse. Please don't collapse. Pretty please. Ask nicely. Please don't collapse. I don't want to have to rebuild the goat pipe. More importantly, I don't want you to collapse and me not realize and then have a problem that my goat pipe doesn't exist. All right. Let me get that done. Uh, next thing I need to do is I need to decide where we're going to start dumping rock in the future. Currently, I'm just dumping it out here, which is good for now, but I want a better long-term solution. Uh, can I get that cut? Yeah, we might as well cut the thing that's sticking up the top. Also cut mining. Just mining that. Cool. Uh, what I want to do is I want to move the shipyard. Now, uh, the good news is in Captain Ministry, of course you can move the shipyard. You can move everything. In fact, we're going to be moving all our starting blocks uh, in today's episode. So I need to get a shipyard. That is 600 construction parts. One, 
plus 800 concrete slabs. We're going to unpause you and we have a problem. Ocean access is blocked. Remember the dock I keep building and saying we're never going to have to move it again. Yep. Uh, low supply of sand we know about. Potatoes don't care about. Uh, and truck can't reach destination six. And that is because somebody, not mentioning any names, we don't lay any blame here. No, we're a fr friendly channel. We don't blame people. Past two there. Uh, went and blocked in our concrete storage. So I need to get a secondary low. Black veil. On that tile, thank you. And down to there. All right, I need to get a second storage for concrete slabs because uh, I need 800 of them. 800 of them to make a shipyard. Construction part one, we're going to be pretty okay on. We've got plenty of those in storage, but that's expensive. Um, so I need to get that built. I also pause. Mm. Probably going to still have overflow. Uh, pause you as well. Yes. Yes. I want to empty these boxes. Okay. Uh, Alright, so that's going to take a little bit of time to get set up. Whilst we wait for that to get set up and moved across, uh, I need to... Uh, what else do I need to do? Ah, oil. We're making a lot of big excavators, uh, which means I'm going to play it safe, and I'm going to enable one more oil refinery, uh, just to have... Oh, 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 oh. Literally mining right underneath it. Gentle. 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 Uh, pretty sure you're fine, actually. Hang on. Did I mark the other boxes? Don't empty. I did not. Off and off. Okay, now you're going to be fine. You'll find a different order in just a second. Yeah, if you just move them, that'll clear the little notification. Because it doesn't clear until, well, they have something else to do. And currently, uh, we have... Uh, enough things for the trucks to do. All right, uh, loose supply of uh, 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 loose supply of rock. Okay, and currently that seems ridiculous because we're mining this one. We're mining a whole lot of rock. Uh, the catch is we're dumping the rock in the sea, and they're not allowed to put the rock in any boxes where they can take it out to anywhere else. So I'm going to have them add rock directly to this bucket, which means this bucket gets except assigned only ticked on. Which is a problem, because I don't want them to just get rock just from that tower. So we're going to untick that, which means you can get rock uh, from anywhere. Plus, uh, the guys that are digging up and carrying rock from this particular mine can also dump it straight into there before they dump it in the sea. All right, next thing I need to do is... Oh, you're done. How cool. All right, we're going to have you aim back at this area for limestone. But I'm also going to remove you. Because uh, I want to get... Uh, left tower is the diggy on the right. I want to assign a whole bunch of trucks over here because I want to have this done. This still has some limestone, plus has some squats, and I really need it out of my way. So the plan is to, well, send everybody over there that we have available. There you go, six. Uh, and have them, well, grab any limestone they can. Refill the limestone buckets. Yes, that is assigned to that tower. And also any quartz they can go dump in our little quartz hill. But hopefully I can get these two to join. If I get these two to join, it means we have quicker access up and down rather than having to use the main ramp. Speaking of the main ramp, you can all get cleared. Great, right, shipyard, you done yet? Close. All right. Uh, next thing I want to do is we've been building for quite some time now. Quite some time now. I've been digging off the corner of this mountain, as you've seen, okay? Making room for more housing. So we've had a problem with housing right from square one, okay? There hasn't been enough room for it. Just like the shipyard is technically in the way of my next project, the housing is definitely in the way of, well, every project. It's just sitting in a bad spot for us. So I'd like to move the housing. So we've been slowly um, clearing our area, adding a couple of extra houses. We only started with two to start with, and then we've cleared out a little bit of area to get a few more in. But I want to put something else up here, which means I need to move the housing. Also means I don't want that farm anymore. We just added a farm that has like irrigation. Actually, we didn't actually bother adding the farm. We can add the farm. Uh, we should probably add the farm. Uh, can I put the farm in there, please? Can I hook in? No. Uh, water pipe. Well, actually, technically, yes, right to there. Cool. Uh, also, irrigation. Hello? Into there. Okay. Can I build that and that? that and 
you don't need that part, so we're just going to remove that. We're going to get you built. Uh, you're going to have veggies and potatoes as well, which means we can get that. And I just saw a truck go around, so we're fine. Okay, uh, can I left tower? No, we don't have any more diggy boys. We're waiting on parts. Uh, they're being made as fast as possible. We've we both through storage. Okay, what I want to do is I want to move housing, okay? Which is... What do you have? Who do you have? Who do you have? It's probably just as important a question. You have rock. You don't have any way to dump rock? Holy crap, they finished. Uh, okay, that's important. Uh, can I get that done? And we might just take this out a few more tiles, I think. Yes. And that means that tower uh, reassign from here to here for the moment. And can I remove all of this? It just makes life a little bit easier to see without the things on top. Okay. Uh, tower on the left can have another diggy boy and another truck or two. Uh, I just want that gone. All right. So. I cleared out a little bit of space. I want to clear more space. Did I just see a truck? No, I definitely did not see a truck drive up that ramp. Okay, I want to clear out more space. I want to clear out a lot more space, but I need to move the housing. I need to pick somewhere to put the people. The people need somewhere to live, turns out. You know, I'm fine for them to be homeless, but it turns out when they're homeless, they don't like working. I don't get what the issue is, but they don't like working. So what I want to do is I want to move the housing to down here, which means I want to remove, well, that farm along with that little storage box. Uh, which means I need to come to this little storage box, box and say, hey, I want an alert if you're down at 25%. That way I, I remember hopefully to put in a new farm. Also, now that uh, Shippy Shippy, which I have been told I should rename to Shippy Shippy, because I keep calling him Shippy Shippy, so at least now that he's named Shippy Shippy, we should be fine calling him Shippy Shippy, who has no crew. We're going to say um, this is now his primary shipyard. So, Mr. Shippy Shippy, the ghost ship, will leave uh, the shipyard, drive off the map. Go, 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 go. And I want to, yep, right there. And then reappear over here. Uh, because Mr. Ghost Shippy Shippy has now found a new home to live, uh, we're going to uh, add a few things. We're going to give him a small upgrade. First thing he hasn't had access to for a long time is automated diesel. So, as I have diesel right here uh, for the this dock, we're going to get that built and that built. Now he'll have automated diesel. He'll be happy, shippy shippy. The other thing he doesn't have is all this crap in here. Uh, the catch is, uh, I'm going to delete that, and then we're going to click quick remove. It's going to cost me 12 uni, but it means that the trucks don't have to physically move this crap from there to there. It'll just happen with the power of belief and it'll get instantly teleported from this shipyard to that shipyard, which suits me 150% because I don't want to wait for the trucks to remove it. It's bad enough that this takes months and months to remove because, well, there, for some reason, the, the scaffolding, it goes all the way into the sea. In fact, it goes well under the sea. I don't know why it goes so deep, but it does. So we're going to have to wait for that to get removed before I can move on to my master plan, my master plan when we start dumping out a second pier. Because we have one pier, but I really want a second pier. Yeah, uh, but now let's do the pier. I want to do the pier. I want to do the pier. I want to plan out the pier. I want to get the pier running. Uh, also, no, we don't need to worry about that just yet. Actually, no, I do want to worry about that just yet. Uh, I want to get another copper smelter running. Uh, we don't need it just yet, but... Oh, pause, 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 cancel. Because you have a little problem. Two little problems. Because past JD didn't flip you. You have now been flipped. You can now be built. Uh, you can also be flipped. And that's the wrong way for the slag, actually. It's the cobalt that needs to be flipped. That one needs to be flipped. And uh, copper, copper, copper. That belt's going to need an upgrade. Because uh, you use 24. So that'll be 24, 48, 62. Yeah, which is more than the 60 belt can support. So we're just going to upgrade that quickly. And that should give me another copper smelter up and running. You're already on the acid recipe. you also full of water, but that's fine. Yeah, it is fine. Uh, off. Yeah, I wonder if I have trucks trying to bring water over here. I hope not. Uh, we'll set all of them to off. Problem solved. Wow, we can get a truck. Oh, we, we can get a truck all the way in there. Okay. All right. Mr. Shipyard is gone. Excellent. Because you guys are already complaining you have no way to dump stuff. Great. What? Yep, yep, yep. Holy crap. 
Well, this ramp's done. Uh, can I extend this out another tile? Cool. That'll let me dump some more quartz. In fact, we'll extend you out two tiles. All right, that fixes the quartz problem at least. Uh, also have another one of those. All right, what I want to do is I want to have a new dumping zone. Uh, now, you may have noticed that it's been here for quite a while. I have uh, pre-marked out the ground. We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35 tiles. At 35 tiles, I'm going to put in a little bit of a flat, and then another little bit of a flat, and then we're going to ramp you down. I'm going to take you down to plus two, and then flatten you back out, and then run a ramp out this way. Uh, like, all, all, all the way this way. Okay. I'm going to need to make this wider, but I do not want to accidentally knock over my poor little liquid dump, so uh, for the moment, we're just going to leave you there. I'm going to grab you, you can go there, and we're going to edit area and assign this... To this area and quick deliver cool uh the other thing i want to do now that that's done is i want to straighten out this coastline so i'm going to have that all that marked flat i'm going to have that marked flat uh you know what just right the way through and i'll remove that that tile here cool uh can i grab you again mark all that okay which means the tower on the right which does the digging on the left i'm gonna deselect rock and slag that can only be trash again uh it means that the rock is now gonna get shin well sent into that bucket should it need to go in that bucket should it not need to go to that bucket it can go this tower once it goes this tower it'll go in the sea in here and we should be able to get a new dock in the reason i want to dock at exactly 35 tiles is that is the far enough apart that I can build a cargo dock on this pier, another cargo dock on this pier facing one another, and all the ships will depart out to the sea down the middle, which I think is gonna look awesome. So I wanna get this filled in. Uh, also, you guys, are you just full of limestone? You are, and now we're finally into the quartz. Gosh, okay. Uh, delete, delete, more deletes, bit more deletes, more deletes, more deletes. Or more deletes. You have rock. You will find someone to put rock in just a second. Uh, I'm going to have a little bit of a problem with probably overloading. Uh, just because there's going to be a lot of trucks that want to dump a lot of material. But like I said, I don't want to break this, this dump. Uh, so I don't even want to flatten across the top of it just yet. Okay. With the shipyard move, new dumping zone set up, uh, limestone being shoved in the shipyard for now, uh, quartz being dug out, ramp being built, yes, fairly successfully actually, holy crap, uh, can I add another set of tiles? Oh. All right, uh, I want to move the housing, okay, I want to physically pack up everybody, I want to spread for you and remove that box, I want to physically pack up everybody and ship them off. So what I want to do is I want to come down here and I need to look at a couple of things. One, I'm going to need a path. I'm going to need a path across the edge here to get trucks through. That's pretty much a definite. Mm, there. Cool. Uh, the other thing is I realize I'm going to build on top of iron and on top of coal. Uh, this is one of the reasons we're probably like you guys have voted. You want me to build in the crater. Which is good, because I can come back and get this iron and coal. The problem is I'm about to build a town on top of it. Uh, which is problematic. So, uh, we want uh, housing services. That's the one I want. Uh, we're going to go with a housing two. I have planning mode on. And I'm going to put the first house right here. This seems like a pretty good spot. I'm also going to grab a service. And we're going to just see that if I put a service anywhere along this side. So, if I did this, 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 this. If I put a service anywhere along here, well, especially around this corner, it's going to block access. So I can't really put services down here, but I can put services up here. Uh, as I need to have access to, well, the sea for things like uh, wastewater, that seems like a not a bad idea. So I'm pretty sure... Can I get a... Building for vehicles. Can I get a ramp? happy with that okay no designations to be mined so you guys are finished okay 
you cannot have any diggy boys. Uh, we'd have you're doing nothing. Wait, Mr. Nothing can go away. Uh, you are gonna do limestone. We're gonna have one diggy boy, one truck. That's all you need. Uh, you are also the nothing tower that was just over there doing quartz. You can also go away. It's just gonna simplify my life. Uh, you are the main digging tower for the team on the, on the left, which we're gonna crank up to now. 20 diggy boys with 24 trucks. Also, it looks like you guys are basically out of space. What's your problem? What are you? Uh, okay, we can have them at least dig out to here. Yep. And I'm going to also split this. So currently, you're doing both waste dumping and digging. What I want to do is put a tower for waste dumping here. I need to remove everything that's got assigned to it. You are dumping a waste only edit area from here to here. And I'm going to have you dump trash all the way out to, well, we might as well try and flatten off the coastline and keep it straight. Why not? All right, uh, which means you no longer need to have dumper trash. Okay, because you no longer need to have dumper trash, we can have you assigned to a much larger area because now you're not going to accidentally overlap with something. And we can, all right, first off, we're going to move all that. Uh, second thing I want to do is I'm going to use the mining tool and I'm going to say, hey, if it sticks up, flatten it. Uh, If it sticks up, flatten it. All right, next thing I want to do is we want this bit. This bit that's sticking up off our ramp, it can also be flat. Uh, we're going to extend... Actually, we're not going to dig any more quartz either. No. So what I want to do is press N. Uh, okay, we're going to dig that. We're going to actually come in from this side. And I want to remove... That's quartz. Okay, I want to remove right up to the edge of quartz as flat. So can you remove that? Oh, can you also remove this? Yes. Okay. I'm going to leave that for right now. Actually, no, I'm going to also add that tile. Uh... All right, we've got overlapping towers and overlapping towers. I know it gets confusing. All right, whoa, no place to dump products, which is, which tower? This tower. What do you have that you can't dump? Wrong. You've got place, no fuel. Oh, it's this. Uh, I need this to be three wide, just due to the sheer amount of rock we're producing. Okay. Uh, potatoes after harvest, don't care. Water resource getting low, don't care. All right, this. So. If I put you there, am I happy with that? Do I want to move everything over a little bit? If I change you to three tiles. Uh, move. Problem with housing is it all needs to be connected to everything else. So if I put you there, if I put you there, can I housing and services and I transform one? I can just sort of put in a transform, but as soon as I put a transformer in here instead, it's still gonna block things off. Okay. And if I put you, 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 you. No, no, okay, no, we're gonna go back to where we were. Uh, I want to have enough room that we can squeeze in uh, to replace the housing I have. Okay, so I'm gonna put you there. Great. Whoever's screaming in the comment section uh, right now about it not lining up with the dark black grid, uh, the good news is that when I do this, the grid goes away. Okay, so this is going to be our plan for our housing block. Okay, something like this. Now, I currently have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight houses. So I need to have at least eight houses. That is at least eight houses with a nine and a ten on the on the edge. Also need to attach services to it. So we're going to get a water a water facility. I'm going to copy that food farm and put you there and that food farm and put you there. Also need to grab a transformer. Uh, we're gonna move the transformer that I'm never gonna have to move again, again for the 18th time down to there. That's the only three services I have. I, I could do bi a biomass collection, but we're not worried about biomass collection for right now. And I think it's gonna cost so many construction parts. Like this is 
1.5k construction parts. Uh, we're going to unpause it. Uh, actually, I'm going to unpause these at least. And the services. Okay. Uh, the services themselves, I'm going to actually pause. I, um, no, I am Yes. I'm going to pause them. I also need to pause the housing. It's going to be very, very important to pause the housing because, well, they don't have services attached to them. So people will start moving in and they're going, oh, I've got nothing to eat because I moved into a house that doesn't have a food market attached. They're needy. They're needy people. What can I say? All right. Uh, I need to get water in here. I also need to get wastewater out. So we're pretty happy with that bridge. I'm going to sort of need a bridge over here. Sort of important because well, this is where this is. Oh, wow. You're out of things to do. Uh, can I get you to get two more excavators? Because I have 30. I want more than 30. I want like 38. Yeah. Uh, can I also... Where is this one? Uh, can I go with... Oh, well, I actually, I want... I want... I have 30. I want 40. So I want to bring eight trucks over here, please. Little trucks. Any little trucks? Hello. Oh, they're going to start doing jobs. Uh, well, that's fine. Uh, we're going to have you upgrade to not a truck, but an excavator. Uh, we're going to have you upgrade to not a truck, but an excavator. We're going to have you upgrade to an excavator as well. Who else do we have? Oh, dear blue truck. No, 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 no. Dear blue truck. Uh, we're going to have you upgrade. I'm going to have you upgrade. Oh, there's another one. You upgrade. Uh, you and you. Okay, you and you, you. And I think that's everybody. You. You're in my upgrade. You are not. You are now. Hey, Tokmiko. Tokmiko ends up going from truck land to excavator land. Uh, cool. He's already got experience, at least doing one of the jobs. All right. I th think... Are you new? You're not new, but you haven't been clicked. Uh, let's talk Miku. I think that's all eight? I oh, know, I wasn't really counting. Probably should have counted. Is that blue truck highlighted or not? Oh, you, cheating. You're highlighted, you're highlighted, and you are not highlighted. So you don't belong to that tower. Nope. Okay. So that'll upgrade those. They'll automatically turn into excavators. Uh, because, well, they're already selected. Can I get you five tiles then? And I'll do it like this. They're just, they're, they're producing materials so fast. We need to have more dumping zones. All right. I need to get this built. We are building this. I need to also get water in here. That's going to be the important thing. So I need to go to uh, this. This is where we're getting our water from currently. And I'm just going to steal it from the same spot. Because well, if the old town set is going to go, then this all becomes free. So I'm going to come up to height three. Uh, we're going to wrap around here and then around to this side of the bridge. We're going to come underneath and then back up and then to this point of the power plant. Now, that does mean excavators can't get into this little section. I don't mind. Trucks can get in there, but excavators can't. Uh, we're also going to come whoop, uh, over to here. Come on, straight lines. There, there, there. Uh, there, and then down to ground level. Uh, it turns out that bridge needs to go there instead. All right, I need to get a bridgey bridge under here. Whoop. Yeah, and then up. Whoop. Uh, there as well. I also need to... I feel like I don't want to move everything left to two tiles. That's not going to happen now. Uh, I need to get you to come to... I don't want to put any pillars on any quartz. So we're going to end up digging out the quartz. Uh, there, to there, to... No, we'll stay high for a little bit longer. And then we'll come underneath, and I'll plug you to here. Yeah, just stop there. And then we'll have a new pipe from there to there, because I'm going to need to put in transports. I want to put in a pipe balancer, because uh, we're going to end up with some alternative water sources in the not-too-distant future. You, 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 uh, you... Uh, oh, cool. I can't afford five construction parts. All right. Uh, I did pause the belts. But I know I paused the belts because I want to do... Remove, 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 remove. Uh, uni. Go away. Storage. Big boy storage. We need some big boy storage in our life. We're going to put you 
here. Hello? There. Cool. Uh, built. Now, these guys hold 360 apiece. That's like 720, uh, 1440? 1440. Uh, this holds, uh, unpause. This holds 2160. So it's a lot more storage. Uh, which means hopefully I can stack up on a whole bunch of construction part threes. Uh, I have a whole pot of ones I'd like to get rid of. And I think what I want to do is just run a belt from there to there. And we'll get you emptied slowly over time. Because... Well, we'd now have to refill this because I need a lot of construction parts for future projects. All right, so we have a new town center up and running. It is full of food. It is built. It is ready. We have not enough maintenance one. Why don't I have enough maintenance one? Uh, because global needs 600 and we're making 480. That's why. Uh, can I unpause you? Cool. Minus 16 workers. Excellent. Uh, we're going to turn off you, you, and crap. Um... Four workers, four workers, four workers. What can I turn off with four workers? Um, Destruction pass three. You'll do. Okay, two workers. Cool. We're fine. We're, we're head above water. Okay. Uh, I need to get the pipe built and pipes built, pipes built, pipes built. And in theory, you'll have water cooked. Also, need to get a second pipe. Uh, this is going to be for the wastewater. We're going to run under here. Uh, over to here, come straight up to height three, and I'm gonna go up our horrible, horrible little ramp we built. Uh, there. Yeah, I know, you wanna go back up on yourself, because pipes don't like going up ramps. They always end up looking, looking like a goat pipe, doesn't matter what I do. Uh, to here. After we get to here, we're gonna go in a dead straight line all the way over to here, down, and then leave you there for one second. I need to grab a dump, and we're gonna put a dump with a dump. Is there any no one going to need two? reason I'm going to need two is you are currently outputting 54.4 wastewater, which is very close to the maximum of 60 that you can output. So I'm just going to put in two. Just, we're going to already know that we need to up the housing. Okay, uh, we're going to bring you into there and then get a little pipe, little pipe, little pipe, little pipe, little pipe, little pipe to go from there to there. Uh, also, if I put this pipe in, I block all Diggy Boy access. Uh, can I remove all of that? Remove, I said. And all of that. Cool. I'm going to remove all Diggy Boy access through here, which is going to possibly be a problem. Um, I don't really want them to travel all the way down, travel all the way up to come over here. So what I'm going to do is we're going to need to bring this down to ground level. So we're just going to remove that much. Uh, I'm going to put in build of vehicles. I'm going to put a vehicle ramp right here because it's already got to come down. We might as well, if we're coming down, come down a little bit earlier and get a ramp in. Okay, that fixes that problem. I also want a second ramp probably right where this pillar is. So can I just remove that much pipe? Uh, put you here. Over one, please. Thank you. Uh, and run you up, down, and back up. Okay. With that done and that done, uh, we're going to get the pipe all built. Yep. That to that to that to that to that. And that picks up our wastewater as well. All right. Then we have the horrible task of moving everybody from this housing to this housing. Now, I'm sure you've done it in your own life. I'm sure you've had to pack up and move houses. We all know how horrible an experience it is uh also just notice electronics are going down I'll deal with that in one second uh there's a free excavator it's not now uh we've all dealt with that before we know it's a horrible experience moving houses nobody enjoys doing it nobody likes doing it even people that have to do it professionally don't enjoy doing it either in capital ministry it's not nearly as bad what we're going to do is we're going to pause the game very important because otherwise people get up upset with you we're going to unpause all of this. We're going to unpause the services, okay? Uh, you don't have water. That's problematic. You do have food. You'll have water in half a second. It's literally in the pipe right outside, and your wastewater is just going to go straight back out. Okay, with that done, uh, we're going to come up to this housing, and I'm going to hit the pause button, and I'm going to select it all over. Well, actually, no, I'm going to come to here. Zero out of 130 people. Yes, 130 out of 130. Ooh, we're going to click that button. Zero out of zero. Perfect. Uh, we're going to just pause all these really quickly. Yep. Uh, not that tower. Uh, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Great. Uh, that gives me housing for 1,040 people, and they should all magically move houses. Hey, everybody moved houses. Perfect. Done. 
quickest move ever. Now, uh, next thing I need to do is, well, I need to empty everything in here. But, research-wise, uh, we have... Okay, I want that, then I want that. How many things do I have to remove to get that? Uh, I want this first. I want this research. Okay, so we're going to remove that. That's down number two. I'm going to re-enable that. Uh, then... Re-enable that. Okay, then I need to... Cancel that, re-enable that. Cancel that, re-enable that. Cancel that, re-enable that. Okay, so you're now two... You're one, you're two, three, four... Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we're gonna get re deconstruction efficiency 10%. This is gonna give me 10% extra deconstru deconstruction efficiency, which is good considering this is uh, like 1300 parts. I'd like to get back 10% extra if I could. But the good news is everybody's moved in the new housing. I need to build this one. Uh, and we need to get that one just up and running. We're also gonna build this one, but I'm gonna leave it paused. I think I'm gonna put another one on here eventually. Eventually, eventually. Uh, but everybody's moved in their new houses, which means I'm happy, they're happy, and as soon as I have the next research done, and, well, some construction parts saved up, because I sort of spent them all. Uh, actually, can I... Hang on, we just turn on new housing. Hang on, electronics. Okay, electronics. We have four coppers up and running. So can I do you, 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 you? Come on, belt, 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 and machine. Uh, you're a manual assembly, you're an electric too. Well, that's gonna be expensive. I should just build the right one to start with. All right, we're gonna upgrade you twice. Not enough workers. Fuel station, out of fuel. Well, but we're working on the worker thing. Maybe we're not working on the worker thing. Maybe we're not working on the worker thing. Okay, we're working on the worker thing. All right, that fixes my worker problem. Uh, you're putting out 2448, so I need to have this belt go faster. Uh, I need to have the, 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 this belt go faster. And I don't need this belt to go faster. We're going to do it anyway. Okay. With those upgraded, you should create copper in, make electronics uh, faster. Uh, also, it means this belt needs to get upgraded. Technically, these ones don't, but we're going to upgrade them anyway. Can I just buy that one and that one? Okay. Then build and build. All right. Uh, which means I make electronics faster. If I make electronics faster, I make constructing parts too faster. The thing limiting my construction part two speed is the fact that you're not upgraded and unpaused. If I do that, we should be able to crank out. If we do that. Uh, so you're gonna use 2448 well over. So I'm gonna have to upgrade that belt for higher throughput. I'm gonna technically have to upgrade that belt and I can do that belt as well. Holy crap, you're empty. Well, if you're empty, uh, can I remove that and that and that and that? And we're just gonna uni remove all of it. And then I'm gonna get another big box. I'm gonna put another big box there. Uh, we're gonna change you to construction parts one, and I'm gonna quick deliver you, and then remove that. If I remove that, that'll unpause that belt. You can go into making construction parts one, which we can then turn into. I'm gonna pause that loop back belt. I'm also gonna have to upgrade that one so it removes the connector in the middle of the belt. And we should be able to pump out, uh, pause, pause. We should be able to pump out construction parts. Also, I think somebody's got sick. Somebody's got sick because it's flu season. And so, okay, there was one thing I forgot. Uh, it turns out I forgot to put in waste collection. Uh, yeah, can we inst- Can't instant build. Oh, I need construction parts, one. Unpause. Uh, high priority. Uh, 20, 20, 20, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Uh, in quick deliver. Because they're full of trash. Okay. Uh, priority five. Get rid of that trash. Like, now. Oh, oops. I Well, we, we had an almost perfect movie movement. Yep, from colony to colony. Uh, can I buy 10 more people? Uh, do you sell people? No. Do you sell people? No. Uh, okay. All right. Minus eight. Uh, do you sell people? We're at minus six. We'll, we'll, we'll recover. And, like, we've fixed the waste problem. No more unhealthy problems. Okay. 
Oh boy. Uh, you're still cracking up parts. Yeah, we're going to leave that. You're running fine. You're running fine. We have the people now moved over. We have room for more people. They will slowly breed up. We have not enough workers, which means you're not running. Uh, of all the things I don't want to run, it is a lab. Uh, copy settings. Yeah, we always set labs, labs to lowest priority because if they don't work, technically they save us uni because each time you have a lab running, you, you're spending some amount of uni on a lab. Actually, it seems like they still use uni Oh no, we've got people back. Never mind. Uh, yeah, so we're going to make more construction parts. One, after I unpause and upgrade you. And now we... No, we've got two workers. Although... Minus one work. Perfect. Which means A-Lab's not working. Okay, and... Three research labs. I wonder if we need to wait part of a month for that to change and see if that changes the number. I'm curious now, it's a curiosity thing. All right, uh, All right. so we're making more construction parts one. They're going to a box, we're making more construction parts two. We have a lot more storage. Uh, it seems like even if the lab doesn't have enough workers, it still costs uni. And I'm definitely gonna call this episode here. It was longer than I expected, but we have the town moved uh, and I am just about to have in this research done, which means I can remove this. Also means we're probably gonna remove this farm, have a bunch of clean space available for our next project. Oh, actually, I can remove you and we can have you dump back into there. Cool, now I'm really, really happy. Anyway, I'm gonna call this episode here. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Do hope you've enjoyed and I'll see you in the very next video. All right, bye.